Linear A is a writing system used by the Minoans Cretans from 2500 to 1450 BCE. Along with Cretan hieroglyphic, it is one of two undeciphered writing systems used by ancient Minoan and peripheral peoples. Linear A was the primary script used in palace and religious writings of the Minoan civilization. It was discovered by archaeologist Sir Arthur Evans. It is related to the Linear B script, which succeeded the Linear A and was used by the Mycenaean civilization. In the 1950s, Linear B was largely deciphered and found to encode an early form of Greek. Although the two systems share many symbols, this did not lead to a subsequent decipherment of Linear A using the values associated with Linear B and Linear A mainly produces unintelligible words. If Linear A uses the same or similar syllabic values as Linear B, then its associated language, dubbed Minoan, appears unrelated to any known language. Topic. Script Linear A has hundreds of signs, believed to represent syllabic, ideographic, and semantic values in a manner similar to Linear B while many of those assumed to be syllabic signs are similar to ones in Linear B. Approximately 80% of Linear A's logograms are unique. The difference in sound values between Linear A and Linear B signs ranges from 9% to 13%. It primarily appears in the left-to-right direction, but occasionally appears as a right-to-left or boosterfeedon script. An interesting feature is that of how numbers are recorded in the script. The highest number that has been recorded is 3000, but there are special symbols to indicate fractions and weights. Signory Corpus Linear A has been unearthed chiefly on Crete, but also at other sites in Greece, as well as Turkey and Israel. The extant corpus, comprising some 1,427 specimens totaling 7,362 to 7,396 signs, if scaled to standard type, would fit easily on two sheets of paper. Crete According to Ilse Shope, the main discoveries of Linear A tablets have been at three sites on Crete Hagia Triada in the Masara with 147 tablets, Zakro, Zakros, a port town in the far east of the island with 31 tablets, and Kania, Chania, a port town in the northwest of the island with 94 tablets. Discoveries have been made at the following locations on Crete Topic. Outside Crete Until 1973, only one Linear A tablet was known to have been found outside Crete on Kea. Since then, other locations have yielded inscriptions. According to Margalit Finkelberg, most, if not all, inscriptions found outside Crete were made locally. This is indicated by such factors as the composition of the material on which the inscriptions were made. Also, close analysis of the inscriptions found outside Crete indicates the use of a script that is somewhere in between Linear A and Linear B, combining elements from both. Other Greek islands Kaya Kathera Melos Samothrace Thera Mainland Greece Mycenae Turins Hagios Stephanos, Laconia Topic. Chronology Linear A became eminent during the Middle Minoan period, specifically from 1625 to 1450 BC. It was a contemporary and possible child of Cretan hieroglyphs and the ancestor of Linear B. The sequence and the geographical spread of Cretan hieroglyphs, Linear A and Linear B, the three overlapping, but distinct writing systems on Bronze Age Crete and the Greek mainland can be summarized as follows. Topic. Discovery Archaeologist Arthur Evans named the script linear because its characters consisted simply of lines inscribed in clay, in contrast to the more pictographic characters in Cretan hieroglyphs that were used during the same period. Several tablets inscribed in signs similar to Linear A were found in the Trode in northwestern Anatolia. 
While their status is disputed, they may be imports, as there is no evidence of Minoan presence in the Trode. Classification of these signs as a unique Trojan script proposed by contemporary Russian linguist Nikolai Kazansky is not accepted by other linguists. Theories regarding language It is difficult to evaluate a given analysis of linear A as there is little point of reference for reading its inscriptions. The simplest approach to decipherment may be to presume that the values of linear A match more or less the values given to the deciphered linear B script, used for Mycenaean Greek. Greek In 1957, Bulgarian scholar Vladimir I. Georgiev published his Le Decipherment des Inscriptions Cretuses en Linear A, the decipherment of Cretan inscriptions in Linear A, stating that Linear A contains Greek linguistic elements. Georgiev then published another work in 1963, titled Les deux langues des inscriptions Cretuses en Linear A, the two languages of Cretan inscriptions in Linear A. Suggesting that the language of the Hyatt Triata tablets was Greek but that the rest of the Linear A corpus was in Hittite Luwian. In December 1963, Gregory Nagy of Harvard University developed a list of Linear A and Linear B terms based on the assumption that signs of identical or similar shape in the two scripts will represent similar or identical phonetic values. Nagy concluded that the language of Linear A bears Greek like and Indo European elements. Topic. Anatolian languages Since the late 1950s, some scholars have suggested that the Linear A language could be an Anatolian language. Topic. Luwian Palmer put forward a theory, based on Linear B phonetic values, suggesting that Linear A language could be related closely to Luwian. The theory, however, failed to gain universal support for the following reasons. There is no remarkable resemblance between Minoan and hitto luwian morphology. None of the existing theories of the origin of hitto luwian peoples and their migration to Anatolia either from the Balkans or from the Caucasus are related to Crete. There was a lack of direct contact between hitto luwians and Minoan Crete, the latter was never mentioned in hitto luwian inscriptions. Small states located along the western coast of ancient Asia Minor were natural barriers between hitto luwians and Minoan Crete. Obvious anthropological differences between hitto luwians and the Minoans may be considered as another indirect testimony against this hypothesis. There are recent works focused on the Luwian connection, not in terms of the Minoan language being Anatolian, but rather in terms of possible borrowings from Luwian, including the origin of the writing system itself. Topic. Lycian In an article from 2001, Professor of Classics Emerita at Tel Aviv University, Margalit Finkelberg, demonstrated a high degree of correspondence between the phonological and morphological system of Minoan and that of Lycian, and proposed that the language of Linear A is either the direct ancestor of Lycian or a closely related idiom. Topic. Phoenician In 2001, the journal Ugarit Forschungen published the article, The First Inscription in Punic Vowel Differences in Linear A and B, by Jan Best, claiming to demonstrate how and why Linear A notates an archaic form of Phoenician. This was a continuation of attempts by Cyrus Gordon in finding connections between Minoan and West Semitic languages. Topic. Indo Iranian Another recent interpretation, based on the frequencies of the syllabic signs and on complete paleographic comparative studies, suggests that the Minoan linear A language belongs to the Indo Iranian family of Indo European languages. Studies by Hubert Lamarle include a presentation of the morphology of the language, avoid the complete identification of phonetic values between Linear A and B, and also avoid comparing Linear A with Cretan hieroglyphs. Lamarle uses the frequency counts to identify the type of syllables written in Linear A, and takes into account the problem of loanwords in the vocabulary. 
However, the Lamarle interpretation of linear A has been rejected by John Younger of Kansas University showing that Lamarle has invented erroneous and arbitrary new transcriptions based on resemblances with many different script systems at will as Phoenician, Hieroglyphic Egyptian, Hieroglyphic Hittite, Ethiopian, Cypro-Minoan, etc., ignoring established evidence and internal analysis, while for some words he proposes religious meanings inventing names of gods and rites. Lamarle rebutted in an answer to John G. Younger's remarks on Linear A", in 2010. Tyrrhenian Italian scholar Giulio M. Facetti attempted to link Linear A to the Tyrrhenian language family comprising Etruscan, Radic, and Lemnian. This family is reasoned to be a pre-Indo-European Mediterranean substratum of the second millennium BC, sometimes referred to as pre-Greek. Facetti proposed some possible similarities between the Etruscan language and ancient Lemnian, and other Aegean languages like Minoan. Michael Ventris who, along with John Chadwick, successfully deciphered Linear B, also believed in a link between Minoan and Etruscan. The same perspective is supported by S. Yatsimirsky in Russia. <laughs> a distinct, otherwise unknown branch of Indo-European. According to Gareth Allen Owens, Linear A represents the Minoan language, which Owens classifies as a distinct branch of Indo-European potentially related to Greek, Sanskrit, Hittite, Latin, etc. At the Cretan Literature Center, Owens stated, Beginning our research with inscriptions in Linear A carved on offering tables found in the many peak sanctuaries on the mountains of Crete, we recognize a clear relationship between Linear A and Sanskrit, the ancient language of India. There is also a connection to Hittite and Armenian. This relationship allows us to place the Minoan language among the so-called Indo-European languages, a vast family that includes modern Greek and the Latin of ancient Rome. The Minoan and Greek languages are considered to be different branches of Indo-European. The Minoans probably moved from Anatolia to the island of Crete about 10,000 years ago. There were similar population movements to Greece. The relative isolation of the population which settled in Crete resulted in the development of its own language, Minoan, which is considered different to Mycenaean. In the Minoan language linear A, there are no purely Greek words, as is the case in Mycenaean Linear B, it contains only words also found in Greek, Sanskrit and Latin, i.e. sharing the same Indo-European origin. Topic. Attempts at decipherment of single words Some researchers suggest that a few words or word elements may be recognized, without yet enabling any conclusion about relationship with other languages. In general, they use analogy with linear B in order to propose phonetic values of the syllabic sounds. John Younger, in particular, thinks that place names usually appear in certain positions in the texts, and notes that the proposed phonetic values often correspond to known place names as given in linear B texts and sometimes to modern Greek names. For example, he proposes that three syllables, read as ke-ni so, might be the indigenous form of gnosis. Likewise, in linear A, ma plus ru is suggested to mean wool, and to correspond both to a linear B pictogram with this meaning, and to the classical Greek word malos with the same meaning in that case a loan word from Minoan. <laughs> Unicode The Linear A alphabet U U was added to the Unicode standard in June 2014 with the release of version 7.0. See also Aegean numbers Cypro-Minoan syllabary Phaistos disc Archilochori axe Dispilio tablet Yora Potsherds Topic References Topic Notes Topic Citations Topic Sources Topic Further reading Best, Jan G. P. Some preliminary remarks on the decipherment of Linear A. Amsterdam, Hackert. 
Marangozis, John. 2007. An Introduction to Minoan Linear A. Lincom Europa, ISBN 3 89586 386 6. Montecchi, Barbara. January 2010. A Classification Proposal of Linear A Tablets from Hagia Triada in Classes and Series. Cadmos. 49 1, 11-38. Cadmos.2010.002. Nagy, Gregory. October 1965. Observations on the Sign Grouping and Vocabulary of Linear A. American Journal of Archaeology. 69 295-330. doi, 10.2307, Palmer, Ruth Linear A Commodities, A Comparison of Resources. PDF. Igium, 12. Thomas, Helena. Understanding the Transition from Linear A to Linear B Script. Unpublished PhD Dissertation. Supervisor, Professor John Bennett. Thesis D. Phil. University of Oxford, 2003. Includes bibliographical references leaves 311 to 338. Woodard, Roger D. 1997. Greek Writing from Gnosis to Homer. New York, Oxford University Press. ISBN 0-19-510520-6. Review. Topic. External links. Linear A texts in phonetic transcription by John Younger. Last update, the 20th of February 2010. Linear A research by Hubert Lamarle D A I D A L I K A. Scripts and languages of Minoan and Mycenaean Crete Omniglot. Writing systems and languages of the world Minoan. Antiche Scritor del Mediterraneo. Antique writings of the Mediterranean. G O R I L A Volume One. Interpretation of the Linear A scripts by Gia Kavashilava Ugarit Forshungan. Band 32.